Hi, this is a tutorial for you to learn how to use your Bluetooth headset with the AD2P feature as a wireless headset for your laptop. To use this Bluetooth headset, first you need to turn it on and then turn on the Bluetooth device on your laptop. After you have turned on the Bluetooth device on your laptop, go to the open Bluetooth settings. Then in that window, select the devices tab and then choose the add button. Then check on the checkbox which says my device is set up and ready to be found and then click next. Then it searches for your Bluetooth headset and if it finds it successfully, it will display it in the list. You can you can tell that this is the Bluetooth headset by just looking at the icon. So t select your Bluetooth headset and then click next. The easy way of doing it is just don't use a passkey. If you prefer using a passkey, you can choose the one found in your documentation and click next. Then it installs the device drivers for the Bluetooth device. And then after this, your Bluetooth device is ready to be used. This message confirms that it is installed successfully. Click finish and then go to select your Bluetooth device and go to properties and then services tab. This displays the list of features which your Bluetooth headset has. Select, make sure you have the headset checkbox selected. And then click OK, which leads you to the installation of the drivers for your headset service. And then when it is done, you are ready to use your Bluetooth headset as a audio output device for your laptop. To accomplish that part, the next step is to go to the control panel, sound settings and in the list of your speaker devices, choose the Bluetooth headset and then select click on the set default. If this, these are your laptop speakers, if you click here and set as default then the audio output comes out from your laptop speakers and when you do this and click set default the audio output comes out of your bluetooth headset after this just click ok and you are ready to go just use any of the media players to check if you get the audio output in that and usually most of the time it works so I, I guess you had a good time learning this and I think this will be very helpful for you and uh, make you feel happy because you don't have any more wires hanging out of your laptops when you're hearing to stuff you can use even this feature even just for uh, chatting with people use it like with Sky, Skype and Yahoo Messenger by choosing your Bluetooth headset as a device, default device for audio output and microphone input. So all the best. I hope this was helpful. Thank you for watching.